I'm a veteran, I've had 13 years active duty experience, and I've been deployed a couple times. Uh, my first concussion was uh, jumping out of airplanes in airborne school. Uh, hit my head pretty good. And uh, then uh, in Iraq, shortly thereafter, I was leading my platoon of infantry soldiers. And on a mission, uh, we had our lead vehicle hit by a roadside bomb. The shock of the explosion caused me to have a concussion. And uh, didn't lose consciousness in that time, but had kind of some fogginess for a while. My third concussion was when I had gotten home, I was doing a hand-to-hand -hand combat course and got hit pretty good and actually lost consciousness for 20 minutes. One of the problems that we're treating here at Texas Sports Hyperbarics is concussions and traumatic brain injury. And it is used to increase the blood flow to the brain and there is good evidence that the increased oxygen that you get while in the hyperbaric chamber increases or speeds the healing of brain tissue. I've just started noticing over the past few years several episodes of what I call fogginess just where I can't concentrate as well. I've even noticed times where songs that I've sung hundreds, sometimes thousands of times, I'll forget the lyrics right in the middle of the song. Luckily, about a year ago, I met the folks here at Texas Sports Hyperbarics, and they told me that they're doing research on veterans that have dealt with serious concussion issues. So I started coming to treatments. It has been used for many years to treat traumatic brain injury, and there's an increasing number of studies out there that show that it is very successful in helping people with both post-concussion syndrome and traumatic brain injuries recover from the trauma to their brain. I've noticed ever since then a significant increase in my ability to focus, my ability to remember. I don't forget lyrics nearly as much anymore. And uh, just in general, just interacting on an everyday basis, that fogginess that prevents me from being able to have a normal life is gone. It'd be neat if veterans knew that, hey, if you've had concussions, if you have, you come home and you're having issues trying to focus, having issues remembering even the little things, uh, you know, there, there's help. And that's something that I think everybody should know. All veterans should know they don't have to live with the effects of war.
veteran where there hasn't been a treatment for something like this, here's something that can make my life quite a bit better. Hyperbaric oxygen treatment works by placing the entire body in a chamber which is then filled with oxygen and we use a pressure of one, one and a half to two times the normal atmospheric pressure and your body is surrounded and you're breathing 100% oxygen so it saturates and, and infuses into all the tissues in the body. Brian is a perfect example of somebody who was in serving in combat, had a traumatic brain injury, um, post-concussion syndrome, and many, somewhere between 25 and 50 percent of these patients, uh, individuals after their injury can have also post-traumatic stress disorder. They can have PTSD with memory loss, difficulty with coordination, anxiety problems, and you know, difficult with crowded situations and things like that, and it appears that the hyperbaric oxygen helps those problems resolve as well. In 2009, Dr. Paul Harsh from Louisiana published one of the first papers talking about the treatment of brain injuries and post-concussion syndrome with hyperbaric oxygen, and since then there have been an increasing number of studies out there that have shown that hyperbaric oxygen can help patients, uh, individuals, recover from these brain injuries even years after the accident occurred. An article was recently published by Dr. Stoller out of Santa Fe, New Mexico, where he treated two uh, football players. One was an NFL athlete that had been injured in the 80s and the other was a 15 year old who had had two concussions in the course of two weeks and he treated them with hyperbaric oxygen and both of them showed significant improvements in their brain function, their coordination, um, lack of headaches or, or their resolution of their headaches and so it appears that treatment of sports related concussions is going to be an area that hyperbaric oxygen will be used more and more for in the future. Texas Sports Hyperbarics has a sister facility in North Carolina, <clears throat> and that facility is involved in a research project through the University of North Carolina evaluating the use of hyperbaric oxygen to accelerate the healing of brain injuries or concussion syndromes in student athletes. And that study's ongoing. We won't know the results of that for some period of time, but it's a clear demonstration that academic medicine is recognizing the benefits of hyperbaric oxygen.